Well, I'm the Duke of Death, and we're continuing our Empire to War Let's Play series as Prussia. So yes, we'll be continuing, we'll just end this turn since this is the turn I was on last time. And so far, the Empire is looking pretty good. The economy is booming. Yeah. I'll build that port next turn, I have a little spare funds. But yeah, most the Empire is most secure. Aside from some people who think it's a good idea to intrude. Oh, that army's not been actually repaired. I'll do that now, actually. I'll wait a turn. Before I attack them. Maybe two turns just to let my army fully recover. Is that all I need? Ah, right. Conversions. I forgot that. Everything seems in order. Yeah, everything's in order. We'll end, we'll end the turn. That gold might have been. They give me so much money. Right. So, we have Venice currently under siege. This army march southwest towards Milan and will basically wipe Venice off the map. That'll leave only Russia in the war of me. Oh, for God's sake, speed up. That'll secure my southwestern front. Now, the southwest totally. Secure, I can start setting up preparation for offensives on Bavaria like I planned. If we take out Bavaria, we could secure about four of our. about three of our. Uh, yeah, it's about three. I'm just trying to remember how many cities they have that are in the objective list. Three of them are in the objective list. We'll be like three more towards our objective Alsace Lorraine, Wurttemberg, and Munich. Yeah, I'm going to destroy that Russian army this turn because I'm not totally amused by that whole I'm going to go round you trick they're trying to do. Come on. Oh, they gave out fight. Oh, what have got? Good. They have four units of actual infantry. It's a little bit depleted, but not enough to really concern me. One unit of artillery, two units of cavalry. Lots of. Them yeah, I'm not going to even bother with you. Yeah, I'm just going to kill all of them. Apparently, I have a chance of losing that. I'm not too sure how you could. But let's find out if the game's on something or not. Once I load up the gate with the battle. <laughs> yeah, so Venice also falls when you open up even more trade in the Mediterranean. The only problem is that. Venice still has Moria, but they'll probably give up after that, or they'll fall to possibly the Ottomans, though the Ottomans end up doing very well against the Marathic Confederacy. Uh, perhaps I should start plans for no, an expedition there, but just overstretch my forces. Also, it's Moria, it's, Greece isn't worth it that much in this time period, it's far more. Right. We we attack, so we'll, we'll have the defensive position this time. Let's move this guy out of the way. Move him on the left side. Give me my you my good cannons. Uh, yeah. They could potentially fall this turn by me doing this, or they could potentially not. Really depends. I also, yeah. Let's get these guys right over here. And also, you've got too many troops on that one side, so... You're gonna be here. Uh, you can like that. Remember to spread them out, because I recall quite correctly that it's not a good idea to keep them all bunched up. And... Carcass shot. Yeah, I'll both of them do that. Actually, explosive shells from you. General, obviously, behind the lines. Secure and safe. Interesting, they're doing this little strategy. Well, they're advancing towards me, so there's that. They're not in rage, surprisingly. I was expecting them to be in rage, actually. No real focus, and it appears as though they're just advancing forwards. All of their, well, the bulk of their professional infantry, if you call them that, are on the right flank. Ooh, they actually have bayonets. 
It's like socket bayonets by the looks of it. They have decent cannons, so there's that. And that appears to be their general. They came into range. We didn't kill any of them, god damn it. You have the explosive shells. Oh, they're backing out. The artillery do its work. I should put them in the fort. Ah, it's too late now. <laughs> it's fine. Oh, there's some cavalry. In for that cavalry unit. There's actually a hill in the way. Oh my god. Oh, that's brutal. I'm going to take a few steps back. Oh my god, that unit's just been torn to pieces. Focus fire on that unit. Oh, they got their artillery set up, but it's not going to do them much good. Yeah, it's also not in range of my artillery, so it's not much point in trying to achieve that anyway. Let's try to blast this one apart. Uh, yes, yeah, micromagic a bit, so aim here. Uh, you could aim, yeah, you aim there as well, actually. Gonna cause their center to have more issues. Didn't hit any of my crew, did they? No, they didn't. Oh, that's... they're just going right around my line, didn't they? That's fine. Charge them. They fired. Charge. Oh my god, it worked. Okay. Yep, we broke their right flank, basically. Yep, that's pretty brutal. We've done it. There comes their cavalry. Charge them now. Aim all artillery in the center. Make sure we don't kill more of our own men, huh? Fire. Yep, we did it. Good. Their arm system right over there. Let's pull our men back. They've done the job. They can be pulled back for safety. For uh, reserves. By reserves, I mean I'm going to bring them back so I can use them again. I don't want. To, in order to pursue them, I'm going to need the cavalry, so it's kind of wasteful to throw them away like that. Alright, get these men in position ready to charge out. Once we're in position. Are they in range of the canister? These guys are. Blast them. Focus on that unit. Lost 10 men on this front. Which is a little bit of a hill here. I didn't notice until I zoomed in. Oh my. Yeah, these uh, these militia units are just not going to And by militia, I mean like this arm scissor and it's not going to do them a good. Yeah, they're all going to die. Alright, you tempted me. Pursue. <laughs> Then I'm going to try to swing around and get that artillery. It appears to be rather busy. And they're gathering up. Also, the artillery needs to set back to normal cannon fire. That is actually quite annoying. I might want to move them up uh, Should I? Probably have time, they haven't got any caving range. Yeah, I'm just gonna have to move them up, that's just trying to annoy me now. Line, advance. Okay, they're done. Uh, bring these guys around so we keep seven them.
have these men make a few steps forward. No cavalry obstacles back here or anything, is there? That I'm aware of now. Set them up. I think they're pulling back. They're not wanting to fight me in the open anymore. Oh, were they scared? <laughs> Come on! Tough it up a bit. Just fired artillery shells directly into your ranks. Like I'm out to kill you. Oh, actually, I'm out to kill you, and I. Oopsie. Let's put some fear into their, into their hearts. Fire into the ranks. I mean, I killed every last man in this regiment. Yeah. Get them all ready so I can swing around and destroy that artillery piece. Oh, well, it's an option. Actually, let's charge it now. So we really need to, to delay that. Oh, that appears to be cavalry. Oh, I missed. Oh, well. oh I got some of them. A little volley got them. Yeah, you're still too far back. That's a little forward more. Yeah, they're they're pulling back into the fortress. I'm not gonna let their cavalry escape. I mean, their artillery escape with them though. They haven't got anything close enough to really intercept efficiently. So yeah, we got their artillery. Looks fine. The cavalry. Only six of them left, it's fun. Move there to the report. I think they're, yeah, they're just pulling back into the fort. It's really odd for the AI to do this, to be honest. There's two left. Kill the last two survivors and we can pursue that unit. Let's try to fracture their force. Probably a better thing than trying to cause too much. Oh, that's good. We managed to try that. We got him. Okay, run after them there. I think they're actually, yeah, they are just retreating. Okay. Get these men over here. Full speed. They escaped, I assume. Yeah, they did. They're all in the fort now, so. Besides from that one unit that's retreated. Unless I want to try and assault the walls, I guess that's it over. Does the game want me to try and assault the walls? Because I will, I have to. Alright, let's move these guys to perfect siege position then. What are you... That's not a good place to shoot at. Yeah, cease fire. We're going to move you a little bit better. What are you, <laughs> you firing at? I wouldn't I really genuinely wonder about this. Yeah, they're all inside the fort now, so I'm just assuming they're giving up, so I'm just going to have them move forward and prepare for the actual offensive. It's pointing, I guess, but I... Oh, they're coming out. I think they're about to come out. No, no. No, they're not. Okay. Bring our force forward to about here. I want to get, like, this whole thing set up so we don't actually get badly mauled by them or anything. Waves up. Fire coming out of the fence. Okay, here we go. Right. Move the howitzers forward, otherwise they're absolutely useless in this range. Oh, they're coming out the fort. We have a we have a winner. Full advanced here. You advanced to. Did you not pack up? Why have you not moved? Hey, when they will ignore orders like that. Yeah, these guys are gonna rest over here for a bit. It's 
The fact you missed is actually kind of shocking. Oh, they're coming out on mass, so good news for me, I guess. Fire here while they're marching out in groups. Oh, there's so many masked up. I really want to just fire into their ranks now. Need to bring artillery forward. About here is where you should be set up. I have the general advance also. The fact these two. Oh, did we. They're bouncing a lot, but they're just not hitting anyone with that. I'm aiming at partly. Well, the biggest unit's here, so fire at that. That's still en route. Where's one's in place? Set it up. Wait. Where. Where's my third cannon? They actually knocked out a cannon. You're gonna be kidding me. Ah, oh, that's annoying. So we only have three howitzers firing on this side. Okay, get these guys into this. Ah, uh, they're not in range. I haven't fired this though. They're in range. Fire here. Here would actually do well. They're just coming straight to range. There's no real worry about that. Oh yeah, the volleys are doing the job now. Uh, first and first. Charge them. Yep, that's just about done it. <laughs> Set up. They're not in range. They must be in range. Oh yeah, that's a general route. Oh dear. They broke. This is more like what I'm after. Okay, charge out. I can just massacre them now. Continue. We're going to just massacre them here. No, no mercy being shown. Straight up kill every last soldier you find. Order all artillery to cease because I actually need to pursue them. But let me do that instead of, you know, poor. Yeah, don't shoot into our men, preferably. Okay, now one of the units can do something else. Oh, actually, you've got you've played your first objective. Good. Keep pursuing. Yeah, we're doing a pretty good pursuit here. Okay, this guy's finished. Go here. You're also finished. Up. Cease. Do not want you shooting my men. God, after all that, our own infantry end up mowing down our cavalry. I'd rather uh, a bit of a twist. A twist that I wouldn't have seen coming most of the time because it's kind of. Ah, never mind. Let's just keep murdering them. They're down to like 15 over here. Oh, this guy's not doing anything. Yeah, you could pursue this guy. Actually, after this one. That one's pretty much dealt with. Yeah, the Venetian army is going to just vanish. Oh, that's. I haven't finished your objective here, I you were. Well, it's just about done. Oh, that's one of my men done with their objective. Where is he? Your new objective. I'm sure you understand that's still your objective. Full speed. I don't think there's any units that we haven't got someone pursuing at, the, at this point. Uh, yeah, continue throwing troops over here. Alright. Seems to be all of them. Seven more. One. That one man mustn't escape. <laughs> yeah, there's only one man in the field now. 
I think one of their infantry units escaped, but it's pretty badly mauled by the. Uh, I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna look at the casualties. It's gonna be fun. So we've killed off Venice, and by the end of this turn, we'll event to wipe out that. Yeah, there we go. Ah, oh, Venice didn't fall. Disappointing. Oh, right. <laughs> I guess we must have another prize. Okay. Put this upright. Show them why they shouldn't rise up. Thank you. And heal. Home. There. Pacify the region. Going to need some garrisons for this in order for this to work. Well, not repair that right now. I need to focus on other stuff. We lost very few men in that, so a quick repair didn't really affect too much. Oh yeah, you're the men that I was going to send off to Milan, right? Uh, keep advanced to Milan. No change in plans there. And we're already healing this army up. So it'll take some time, but it can be done. We're going to kill the Russians. Ah, that's what I was doing, right? Russians. What's the research we're doing? I should check up on that. Interesting. I think. Yeah, you're dead, man. Just accept that. Fun. I'll resolve. I hate you so much. You you don't comprehend my hatred, Russia, when you just run in deeper into my territory like that. Okay. This will be just fix this real quick. I'll resolve. Thank you. And heal. Yeah, it also gives my general thoughts traits by just letting it all resolve. Boop. And I'll need you to go just again. I think that's all the repairs I really need to do, in all honesty. Our income went up a little bit, good. Did the mine finish this turn? No, next turn that finishes. In which case, let's yeah, keep upgrading the mines, yeah. So if we need to go to, uh, to Bavaria, what do we have to do? Cannons. I'd take... I'd almost take Munich. Yeah, Munich would just fall instantly, besides the few. Uh, this place... Apocal... Wait, they have a machine gun. Hazards. Interesting. Okay, they, they've got very few men, but... The big army is being France, so if I set three armies to simultaneously besiege three of these, I would almost certainly have secured this area. Okay, so I've got two armies in the south once I pass by this region. Where is that third army? I guess I'd have to buy that third army with the money I'd gain from the income tax from here. And once I've got them stalled here and, you know, all this area fall, I could push into France and that's good. So who is Bavaria allied to? Only Britain. No, Britain. Uh, that's the issue here. I don't really like the idea of fighting Britain while I'm trained with them. No, that's fine. We'll end this turn. I'm trying to heal up the garrison in Vilnius. Good, finally. Worried they weren't going to join. Good, that means that next time I'd launch my attacks, I could take out the Polish cities at last. So, I'm going to need a third army in the east. Where am I going to find that third army? Oh my god, for God's sake, that's two giant armies there. Mm. It's going to be quite difficult. Russia, Russia, Sweden. That's bad. Copenhagen just fell to the Swedes. That's not good. The Swedes have a good hold on the Baltic now. To compete with our current dominance of the southern coast. Hanover's marched north. Are they at war with Sweden still? If they are, they might be able to at least keep them... Oh, they've attacked again, have they? Why do I not have a good chance of winning this? I don't understand. Is it the general? 
because I've got a very good general to counter that. I'm just going to fight this myself. Because I don't trust your resolve to win that, because your resolve can be a bit in incompetent at times. It comes to sieges. Okay, so Venice will fall. Sweep west, take Milan. And then I leave one army in Italy. And then forget the Bavarian plan again, move this one of these two armies east. Once I've garrisoned this down. And then I actually can make some progress in the eastern front. It's going to stretch the campaign out a bit, but there's not so much else I can do about it. I'll secure my east in front to actually give me some more men to throw elsewhere. Come on. Here we go. Right. And it's foggy as hell. Typical. Move this unit out of the way. Nope, that's not very good. Like that. There. Move to the left. They have one cavalry regiment, so they could try that. Uh, make sure the howitzers are in position. Why would you ever deploy your ca- I just saw that. The cat, why would you ever deploy your cannons like that? That's such a dumb formation. Okay, get that there. Uh, now for the cavalry. Have the fresh cavalry do their stuff this time around. You're going to be on the right flank, but we can still move you pretty freely. These guys are going to be reserves, so let's stay here. On with the general. And before we do anything else, how far away are they? Too far for an actual canister. But on the other hand, fire. Oh, that's the general's bodyguard. Let's kill him then. Ah, uh, you're still using regular. That's not good. Oh goody! So much artillery just fired in there. The cavalry is already. Oh my! Only four men survived that. Okay. Apparently, not a single infantryman died in that volley. Just kind of impressive. Fire to that, it's the biggest cavalry unit they have. You guys on the other hand, I'll give you full full discretion about that. Other one, here we are. Beat it up. We haven't killed the general yet. They are starting to maul their men though. Oh, the general's dead huge blow for their forces. They think this is the wise choice. This could be fun. Get out of cavalry ready to do the pursuit. Have all the cannons aim at this unit. God, that's terrifying. They're still steady, I'll give them that. They've got some morale to them. But we're now going to break all their hopes in a single charge. Try to get inside the fort. That's kind of funny. What did them any good, though? Fire the volley. Oh my. They're wavering. Okay, we've done it. Fire. I mean, cease fire. Cease! I think we timed that pretty well, to be honest. We didn't lose any of it. Oh, that's it for the start.